Hey guys, so today I'm going to be filming a little get ready with me. I'm going on a daytime date. I think a daytime date should be just like a little more light and fresh. So let's get into it. Starting out with my The Body Shop Seaweed Mattifying Day Cream. I'm sorry this is really repetitive. I know I use this like all the time, but it is so good for oily skin. I use it really in place of like a moisturizer and a primer. For all day oil control, I'm going for the NYX Matte Finish Long Lasting Setting Spray. I used this actually before I put my foundation on and I find that is the most effective. Especially with like outdoorsy dates, if it's like really hot out or you just have really oily skin, definitely use mattifying products. So my ultimate like light and airy kind of foundation concoction is actually using the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation and mixing it with the Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel. This combination guys is insane. It looks exactly like skin but you still get like the oil control and like kind of the coverage and the powder finish of the Estee Lauder Double Wear but the gel like sinks into your skin kind of making the foundation sink into your skin and not sit on top of it. So I pretty much take like a half and half measurement of it so I'm taking like you know a good chunk of the foundation. Two pumps or like a pump and a half of the moisturizing gel and as you can see like that's just like a little bit too dark for my skin so I'm gonna add a couple drops of the body shop shade adjusting drops and the best way to apply this is with your fingers rubbing and then as it starts to set because it does set very quickly then you'll have to start kind of um, patting it I mean, obviously the moisturizing gel does dilute the coverage a bit, but I'm okay with that because the reason I love this foundation so much is because of its oil control and the finish of it. I'm pretty happy with the coverage and everything, but I'm just gonna go in with a little Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer, just a couple dots underneath my eyes. And then while I wait for my foundation to just kind of set totally, I'm going to do my brows, and I'm actually trying out a new brow product today. I'm using the NYX Micro Brow Pencil, and I have the shade Taupe. So we're gonna see if this lives up to my favorite Annabelle skinny brow. I'm just going to use my MAC Blot Powder to just set around my eyes and a little bit on my cheeks for a kind of bronzy glow but not really bronzer I'm gonna be using this hard candy tiki bronzer and I'm just using the Real Techniques stippling brush and this isn't really like a bronzer I mean it, it's supposed to be but it's doing a very light job and I just really like the subtle color and glow that it gives me. For eyes, I'm also trying out this new eyeshadow. This is by Essence and it is a matte eyeshadow in the shade 16 Triple sh Chalk. Or shock. C-H-O-C. Probably short for chalk. Now I'm going to take a smaller eyeshadow brush and just go all over the lid. And 
And I'm just gonna take one of those like crappy foam eyeshadow applicators that come in like, you know, you know. Put a little bit of that underneath of my eyes. This is actually a really great tool for underneath the eyes, just to like smoke it out. This is the Hard Candy Candle Lit Highlighting Duo, and I'm just gonna take this lighter shade over here with my finger and just brow bone highlight a little bit. I wasn't going to add any blush, but I think I will. This is the Essence Silky Touch Blush in number 10, Adorable. is the L'Oreal Voluminous Mascara in Black Brown. For lips, I'm gonna go for like a kind of pretty pink color. This is the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Milan. Look at how pretty that is, yes. Anyway guys, this is the look. I hope you liked it. I think it is effortlessly like cute and fun and not, you know, too overdone. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and you can always subscribe. I put out new videos every single week and I would love to have you be part of this little channel family that I'm growing. Thanks again so much for watching and I will see you in my next video very soon. Bye.